During the Necker Ridge expedition, we'll be exploring deep sea fauna near the Hawaiian Islands. Have you ever wondered how this archipelago formed? You might be aware that the core of our planet is incredibly hot. So hot that it's composed of melted rocks. In some areas, the magma is hotter than in others, creating a hot spot that melts through the crust. This is an incredibly important process that keeps the shape of our planet constantly changing. The Hawaiian archipelago, formed by hotspot volcanism, is the perfect example. Right in the middle of the Pacific plate, magma rises upward through the cracks and erupts on the seafloor. The volcanic material keeps accumulating, growing towards the surface of the ocean, and sometimes creating an island. But there's another element which is fundamental. While the hot spot itself is fixed, the plate is moving towards the northwest. In fact, the Pacific plate is moving with the same speed at which your fingernails grow. So as the plate moves over the hot spot, the string of islands and seamounts that make up the Hawaiian island chain are formed. Corals colonize the growing seamounts. Through time, the corals will create a sturdy reef that surrounds the entire structure. As a seamount or island shrinks because of erosion, mass wasting, or simply because of the enormous weight of the structure actually bends the plate on which it rests, corals cover it completely, becoming an atoll. An atoll is a ring-shaped coral reef that encircles a lagoon partially or completely. The Hawaiian archipelago is composed of 132 islands, atolls, reefs, shallow banks, shoals, and seamounts stretching over 1,500 miles.